that is spicing up in the league. We can actually potentially finish fifth. Um, let's not jinx it though, but yeah, one point behind Arsenal, so, uh, who's played one more match than us, that's it. So, um, <clears throat> yeah, and uh, sixth place is definitely guaranteed. I mean, we can't slip down. So, yeah, let's get into it. Roll the intro. Welcome back. Are you crazy here? And uh, yeah, I hope you're enjoying the journey as I certainly am. I can't stop playing. I mean, this is just my third day now and the season is now going to be over. So oh, it's spicing up though. Uh, I've, <laughs> I'm on the screen because you obviously have to see this. I beat Newcastle 3-2, right? They had three shots on target at least and they scored two of them and I was fuming. Notice our goal scores though. Anderson, Christensen and Kea. We scored from three corners. That's it. Nine shots of target only out of 25. It was one of those games. <clears throat> yeah, other than that, we also beat West Brom 3 2. I mean, should we look at the stats? I mean, why not? Yeah, <laughs> absolutely dominating on that one as well. And we only win, win 3 2. I mean, <sighs> infuriating, but I mean, we got through. And then a 1 0 win versus Leeds, where honestly, they were kind of dominant, so we kind of stole it, which. Mm, I guess it's fair enough here and there, but yeah, today we're playing Bulls and Burnley. And this is the team we're gonna play. It's Vass, Anderson, Christensen, Paulson. It's very familiar now. Hoybia, Delaney, Sko, Eriksson, Bun, Larsen, and Paulson up front. And uh, as you can see, our squad is still very strange, and people are knackered and not registered and all sorts. So, um, yeah. And off we go! Now, I told the lads that we are favourites because um, apparently we are, so let's let's just stick it to them. And uh, <clears throat> I did notice something a little funny. Um, <clears throat> they have my old player playing as my scout is running around behind me. She's getting ready for transfer window. Um, speaking of, I mean, transfer window is going to be super duper boring. <laughs> it's usually the one I look forward to the most. But yeah, I mean, I'm not going to be able to really buy any players uh, unless they're Danish, of course. And I think I've kind of run out of options in terms of Danish players. But I mean, I could buy back, for instance, Mr. Yannick Vestergaard, but I, I don't think I should, right? Um, so yeah, I don't think lots of transfers are going to happen until the regions start developing around the world, the, the Danish ones. Um, but yeah, you never know, and random players may just suddenly like pop up on my screen, and I'm like, <laughs> get him! As I'm just rambling, as we have a free kick and scope. Well, he hits the wall twice. I mean, it, it was that some sort of personal thing? He was trying to injure the. Oh my god! And then he loses the ball. Yeah, I guess it was revenge for bloody hitting him twice, which is fair enough, I guess. As Raúl Jiménez is in, and uh, yeah, that was that was very easy from them, wasn't it? <clears throat> Not good at all from us. Vitinha with the ball, and then just. Do you see the one with the assist? He is. It's just a nice ball. Why are we... Uh, that's not good defensive work there. It's like both players were going for the same player and I yeah, just forgot all about Mr. Jimenez, which is a bit silly. But uh, yeah, let's fight our way back into this because, I mean, there is some money on the line, I guess, if we finish fifth instead of sixth. I mean, that is just silly. Also, it's just nice to have a bit of bragging rights over Arsenal in it. But yeah, it. I'm a bit worried here. What are you having a laugh? I thought this was over. We're apparently favourites, so why is this happening? So two calamities at the back. I mean, it's good hold up pay from Mr. Jimenez, and then just nothing to worry about, right? <coughs> Fuming. Right, and that's literally it for the half. I'm gonna go mental. Uh, you're much better than stuffing. No, wait. You have the ability. Yes, go out there. That was shocking. And we didn't even have a proper highlight ourselves, which is even more depressing. Um, because we're always gonna make defensive errors, it seems. But yeah, usually we just score more goals than them or something. And uh, okay, I mean, yeah, sure, Adama Traore is very fast, but uh, he usually can't finish. He's the, uh, well, he's the Premier League version of David, is it David? Romedale, at least. Danish people will know. He was, uh, he would have 20 pace, 20 acceleration, no doubt, but he was rubbish. That was literally all. The rest of them would be one. 
especially crossing. Crossing would be like minus one his attributes. Um, I'm just gonna berate them honestly. Uh, are we just gonna get absolutely like embarrassed here? What is going on? I, I turn the camera on and then I mean this happens. I mean, <sighs> I don't want to blame you guys, but I mean, I like, do I? Okay, Paul Larson is having another shocking game. He really is out of form at the end here of the season. Um, I don't even know why I keep starting him. I just, I think I forget. <laughs> I honestly think I forget. And then when it, when, by the time I take him off uh, in game, which is inevitable because he's playing like shit. Well, sorry for my language. Uh, I then remember again, but then I forget. I mean, the Braithwaite, that was your moment. You could have earned your Braithdino tag there. Um, wow. What's going on with Wolves anyways? Like, I mean, they're 12. They literally have nothing to play. I guess they're playing for a top half finish, maybe. But yeah, I mean, should I? I'm gonna have to just make one last change because actually, no. I'm not gonna put Fisher on because Fisher keeps whining. He wants to leave and all sorts. And uh, so he's in the doghouse for me. <clears throat> but um, yeah, wow. Well, that was bloody depressing. Not good, not good at all. Now, uh, okay, so let's see. Premier League, what is the last? The last round, Arsenal, oof, Arsenal go away to United. That is brutal. Oh, and I just noticed that City have actually won the league now. Good for them, good for them. Congrats to you guys. And uh, of course, we play away to Burnley, so there's a small chance that we can uh, are United playing for anything I mean they're playing to keep their fourth uh, third place uh, so yeah <coughs> there's that but uh, yeah fast forward and uh, on let's get some revenge on Burnley right and we're back lads for the final match of the season and as you can see we are proper knackered our players are well they want to go home <laughs> early I guess but uh, yeah we're not gonna allow them at least some of them are gonna be on the bench but a uh, lot of rotation is happening because of it so it's going to be Mele at right back, Anas and Christensen at back, and then Skull, our right winger, is actually going to play left back, which is uh, a bit problematic. But Hoybia Delaney stays in there in the middle, uh, Damsko on the right, Lucas Anasen in behind the striker, and Fischer on the left, and then Paulson up front. And uh, yeah, not ideal, but on we go. Now I told the lads I want to see a much better performance than the last game, and frankly I do, and I think you guys deserve as well. So, uh, yeah, let's actually try this game. That would be fun. Of course, we're playing the Sean Dyches Burnley, who have nothing to play for, I checked. They are safe, even though they are... I mean... What about trying? Uh, were we going to try ever? I'm just going to berate them straight up. I mean, yeah, we don't need to see that again. Well, this is fun. I mean, okay, we have a corner now. Uh, Delaney... Christensen is very open out there randomly. Um, why is he keep? Why is he staying up there? He's a central defender. You pull him. Apparently, we was offside as well. So, why bother? Okay, Mele with the throw into Anasen. Okay, Skull picks it up though. Delaney finish Paulson. Thirty-first goal of the season for Yusuf Paulson. Yeah, I don't know how either. Um, so, can't complain. It's a great little cross from Skull, I think. 1-2 uh, with Delaney, and then just, oh, first time as well. And then Paulson just heads, heads it in. Nicely done, lads. And that actually moves us up to fifth place. So, yeah. Very, very interesting. <coughs> oh, as I can see, United are smashing Arsenal. 3-0 already after 22 minutes. Ooh, Paulson is in. He's in. And he hits the bloody post. Paulson! See, imagine that. So he scored 31 goals. Imagine how many chances that is. That's like 300 chances. 300 clear cut chances, basically. Speaking of, I mean, how daft is it that you can't see clear cut chances anymore? Why? I know that they made XG, but why not just have both? I, I don't understand. Because the XG clear, it's clearly not working in intention, like in, as intended. It's just daft. Why not just have both, as I? The, why? But uh, yeah, as we now see, Burnley coming forward because I slag off Sports Interactive so they listen and then they say oh, let's mess with him make Burnley the best team in the world suddenly well behind Wolves of course 
Right, well, only 1-1. One, one. I'm gonna... I'm not happy, lads. Come on. Seriously. <sighs> I mean, uh, I'll take a 1-1. One, one. <laughs> what? D I'm sorry, what? He has the ball and then suddenly makes a slide tackle pulls and What the... I know you're pressing forward, but that doesn't mean you need to tackle yourself. Oh, you are, and this, I mean, 100%, this is going to lead to a goal. We all know it. Everyone knows it. Exactly, right? I need to see this again. Okay. <clears throat> right, we all need to see this again. So Paulson has the ball, he runs with the ball, and then he slide tackles himself. And it leads to a goal. Yes. And now we're sixth. Why aren't you scouting, honey? Okay, Paulson throws this down to Anderson, who just, just passes it to Pope. I mean, I know it's Pope Francis and all, but you don't need to do him any favors. <clears throat> okay, McNeil, I mean... I mean, this is getting stupid. I mean, what a way to end the season. Uh, we can't beat Burnley or Wolves. We've been on such a good run and then, yeah, crunch time and we just stop trying at all. I mean, are we defending that? Are we not? Mele? Are you? Hello? I mean, this is pathetic. I don't want to see this again. Okay, it's bloody end this game. Fisher is playing sh crap as well. It doesn't matter who we put on the left. So, do you know what? I'm going to put Mr. Jensen out there. Inverted winger support. Yeah, why not? The 15-year-old, he's going to start. Oh, well, not start, but he's going to get his game down. I mean, he can't possibly do worse than Fisher. Okay, let's just, just do some more changes, because why not? I mean, everyone's just playing terribly. Yeah, Braithwaite on. I mean, who cares? Just end this game, so end this season. I... Yeah. I'm just not gonna... Just made the last change. You saw it. You saw what happened. You literally saw what happened. And now this, even though there's only five minutes plus a bit of extra time, this, this is gonna literally last five minutes plus extra time because it's gonna be one li long highlight. And they're gonna score five goals or something. Right? I mean... Okay, that I mean that's literally what we needed. Definitely what we needed now. So now we're nine men. I mean, are you having <coughs> very? I mean, we we're, we're nine men, guys. Well, at least they didn't score. So there's that. Thank you. I'm far from pleased. What else do you want me to say? Viewing. Right, well, let's take stock of the Premier League, though, after that terrible, terrible, bloody performance. So, actually, now we're in the Euro Cup 2 instead of the Euro Cup. It actually mattered. It literally mattered. And we couldn't beat either Wolves or bloody Burnley. Who on earth? I mean, maybe we can win the Euro Cup 2, but Tottenham are in there as well, somehow. So, we finish ahead of Tottenham. I mean... Joseph Paulson at least get top goal scorer in the Premier League, which I have no idea how. Uh, I mean, Martial being up there is also a bit of a surprise, right? But I mean, he's good on <laughs> he's good on paper at least. But uh, yeah, not good at all. I mean, that was just rubbish. But yeah, City win it. Uh, interestingly, West Ham get relegated. Um, Crystal Palace and West Brom. Let's see uh, who is getting promoted actually. I would. I want Brentford to be promoted because they have all the Danish players. I mean, I kind of have them now. Maybe that's why they're so so bad because I kind of stole all their Danish players, didn't I? Uh, so yeah, there's that. Um, but yeah, Norwich and uh, Watford at least, and then Forest or Bournemouth. Uh, interesting, but um, yeah, I mean, just look at this. These last two matches, right? Zero three, one four. And we went out the Euro Cup to young boys. Yeah, that is depressing. 
But so what, so what is actually happening in the bloody Europa Cup? A final between Lazio and Bayern. I mean, it could have been, could have been us, but oh well. Mm, yeah. Danes manager slam team. Absolutely right. That was shocking. Uh, anyways, if you enjoyed my some more of my proper rage, then uh, yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe and all that. And uh, we'll be back for season two. Whoa!